It's the most wonderful time of the year With the kids jingle belling and everyone telling you be of good cheer Hello, this is Clone Wars Weekly. I'm your host, Ronan, with... Patel And Quentin. You always say Q&Q films. I'm surprised that we're going to do it differently this time. Q&Q films. Okay. Well, um, and this week we shall be going over our wish list for The Clone Wars because it is Christmas. And we want to see stuff in The Clone Wars that they're likely never to show. So, Uh, sit back and enjoy the program. Yeah, it might actually be pretty fun. Favorite? What the hell is a favorite? What, what, what I don't the hell? Know. Okay, so who's gonna start off I this? Shut up! I will kill you. So who's starting off this chicken scratch oh, episode? Me, me. Okay, okay. question last. Ronan, you go yeah. first. <laughs> um, wait, what? No, you, you're last, fool. Ronan, go, go. <laughs> All right. Well, first off the bat, you know it's me. Uh, I want to see more Rodians, okay? What can I say? Like, in this show, they've mostly just been used for disposable characters, or Anaconda, or Bala, but, um... Or Pablo. They've also done a good... If Pablo didn't die, you imbecile! Um, That's what you think! Maybe he got, like, some sort of a disease and died later on in the show. <laughs> but you just don't know <laughs> Anyway, uh, one thing I will say about the Clone Wars is that they've actually treated Rodians pretty much the best of any Star Wars media I've found, which is kind of sad when I think about it, but I actually got to see their planet. Uh, They've been treated as actual individual beings rather than uh, thugs and just scum, but I would like to see that maybe capitalized a bit more on because there's plenty of opportunities for characters where they just use a stupid human and instead they could do something else. No, it's not that I hate humans, I just find them a bit overused. You're prejudiced against humans! No, I find them overused because every Star Wars main character you will ever think of is a human. But you're a human! Not Chewie or Yoda. Chewbacca's not a main character! How many times do I have to explain what? this? Or <laughs> Yoda's not a main character. <laughs> he sort of uh, just sits around and gives wisdoms. Or Ahsoka. Ahsoka is actually the first alien main character. Uh, There's no other main characters that are uh, alien. R2. R2, R2 just did it! <laughs> um, Can someone just kill him? They had to be not alien. Um, he said... Main characters. That's also true. Yeah. The show. Okay, can someone just kill him already? Just, just keep going, Ronan. Damn it. I'm, I'm okay. Gonna... Well, um, I'm gonna move on now to Batil to see what his first oh, wish. So is. you go? <laughs> no, I'll be coming back to me. Oh. Okay. Just have to go like within the flow, you know. Okay. Okay. So what would I want in the Clone Wars? Hmm. This is a good one. Hmm. <gasps> I got it. This might piss you off. <laughs> okay, what they need to do? Need to go to Mustafar. Need to, to wake up HK47 and let him go oh, loose man. some galaxy. And he could be all like, "I could just take the rex him," and then he could like, <laughs> and the clones would be like, "Ah, I want you to die," and then Jedi would like, "Ah, don't kill me," and HK would like, "Boom, dust the darn meat bags." <laughs> That might actually be kind of interesting. This I wouldn't, I wouldn't see that. It yeah, would I'd love be to awesome. see HK back. No, 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 wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. If this is what I would want, this is like a Christmas thing. Okay, this is what I would want, right? You get HK, shows up, right in front of Bane's little apartment. He goes in, like Terminator. He's like, you time to die, blue man. And then he just like blows Bane to friggin' smithereens. Like just blue splats all over the wall. What would it be green splats? Green splats all over the wall. And... Then HK takes his hat and runs away. <laughs> I love that. I, that is awesome. Oh. That be legendary. <laughs> no, not yet. Oh. It, 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 it actually... Whose turn is it? That actually would be pretty cool to see HK back because, like, 
I mean, he's maybe not the best character, but dang, is he funny, and he's pretty darn awesome, too. He's brilliant! So, uh, I, would, I could imagine him easily translated over to the Clone Wars style of animation, too. Unless they screw him up, like, his backstory, and then that would kind of... True. Like, what if they bring him in, and then they're like... And they they make this master like fast life. Like, what the hell is this crap? <laughs> <laughs> that that's what I worry about. If they ever do bring him in, you saw what they did with Grieve with this. Imagine what they do with like an EU character. True. Well, oh, God. Perhaps uh, let's just consider the fact that this is a wish list, okay? So since it's not likely to happen, we'll just pretend it's going to appear in its best best form. I don't care. I'd still want to see him go in the clones and beat the crap out of pain. That would be awesome. Yeah, I, yeah, I agree. I, I love seeing that. So, and Quentin, it's your turn now. Oh, boy, yay! You know what I'd like to see in the Clone Wars? Echo come back to life. <laughs> Only to die a few seconds later because it was... <laughs> Be interrupting the space-time continuum. Oh my god! <laughs> See, this is what would happen. He would come back. So no, 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 no. no. Look, he'd come back just as he's getting up from the ground. A gunship just lands no, straight no, on. No, he'd, he'd get up like Iron Man, and the um the giant cannon thing would shoot at him again. He dodged a bullet, pull out his wrist rocket thingy. Shoot at it, walk away slow motion as it explodes behind him. Cause he's freaking Echo. I Wow. Do you have wrist rockets? I don't I don't even think they can walk in slow mo. I don't think they even know how to walk. I don't think they know what slow mo is. I've never seen a clone do anything badass in slow motion. Surely they've seen the hollow films though. They've died in slow motion. <laughs> Oh, well, I don't even God. know. Oh, they can't even die in slow motion. <laughs> but no, Echo, he'd, he'd get up, gunship, just go... Pfft, flatten his ass right back into the ground. I think this is what Cora used to talk about with crushing one's hopes. I didn't really <laughs> notice it until now. <laughs> what? I didn't crush your hopes. Okay, that's true. But, I mean, come on, it's... It's his wish list. He'd want Echo to come back to life. <laughs> Only to die again. <laughs> I can't die. But he already died. He can't How many die. times do you have to establish the same thing over and over? Every week, it's the same thing. You're like, Echo didn't die. I'm like, yeah, yeah, he kind of did. You're like, no. Somebody come up with a liable position for how Echo is dead. He got his ass blown off the end. Do you remember that one guy that gave us a comment that in our last video that said that Echo didn't die? I respectfully disagree. I approve that comment and it deserves behind and it deserves a golden sticker. And cookie. It's an oh, accurate. Oh, oh, and pumpkin muffins and Kool-Aid and cake and Echo. Anyone else want lunch? Uh, tempting, actually. Clinton, what the hell is wrong with you? Ooh, what, 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 what the hell? Okay, you know what? We're we're switching over from you now. Okay. Go back to Ronan. Well, this one ain't going to be quite as funny, but it's something I've desperately wanted to see in the show. Ah, better writing. <gasps> what? Wait, Wait, which episodes are overall? Now... Don't get me wrong. This show has had plenty of fantastic episodes that makes me truly marvel at how they've gotten better since the prequels. But, um... I mean, just like... You know, they make idiotic mistakes that I've never seen other shows do and consider it good writing. Like, why would they do that? Okay, let's start it off. Let's see. Batil's favorite episode, A Friend in Need. Wait, what, what the hell is this crap? What, what is this blasphemy? You love Bo-Katan, man. Yeah, but that doesn't mean I like the episode. Okay, good. Okay, good. <laughs> but I love Bo-Katan. Hot. 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 Hot.
Anyway, anyway, that episode was like the epitome of terrible writing in season four. And then again, Slaver Art kind of threw that one out of the water, but still, it was pretty bad. Um, like, I tried to forget about it, too. Um, hey, at least they weren't Rodians. That's next season. <laughs> so, 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 so better writing, writing, like, writing. It, I neglected to bash it last episode because I co- tried to completely blot it out of my mind. Uh, it had some cool concepts, like the environment was awesome, but when they came down to it, they made Ahsoka run away from helping these villagers. And that was not within her character at all. Maybe they implied they all died in the fire. That's uh, kind of a big implication. Anyway, they, what should have happened, even at like, the very least, they could have had an extra line at the end, like her saying that uh, she's just going to need some support on this planet to go back there and stop Death Watch or something. If they had been truly good writers, they would have had her stay and actually try to help these people. Like, that is what Ahsoka's character is like. And these idiot writers just... Okay, I'm going to stop now. Okay, I hate the slaver arc, too, but I'm trying not to bring that up. I'm just bringing one specific example of a friend in need as being a source of bad writing. Okay, fools, I'll tell you what I want to say. No, 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 no. How the slaver arcs could have built a lot on, on Ahsoka's No kidding. It sucked. It really bad. It sucked. Yeah, it did. So you know what they need to do? You know what another thing in my wish list is? All right, what's on yours? They need to... Bring back... This is going to piss you off. Delta Squad! But, sir... Kirk, you and your continuity... But uh, they need to bring back Delta Squad, and it would be awesome. I guess it could be. Have them do something. Yeah, I mean, like, they have the character models. Actually have them do I'm glad that they aren't in the show, but, I mean, like, they have the character models to be able to do them, and I know that they're insanely popular with the fans, so I wonder why they haven't. Well, tough. You will be destroyed. But no, I love Delta Squad. I, oh, you, Scorch, man. I love Scorch. You know why I love Scorch? Karth. Not because Karth and Karth. Clone Armor. That's literally what he is. Dude, but no. I like Scorch. Now you ruined my rhythm. Good job. But I would like to see Delta Squad come back and actually do something. But how would that work? Would they, like, give them all, like, the Karth voice and the weird, like... Odd voices for them, or they just have like D Baker do them. They probably have D Baker do them all, which would be a bit odd, but you know. But then D. Baker's awesome. But then Scorch wouldn't be Karth, and Sev wouldn't sound like a chain smoker, and Kixer wouldn't sound like my mash heap. <laughs> That's no fun. You could bring back Karth. Yes, that would be to loads of fun, actually. Eat Karth in there. Without Karth, it's, it's just not. It's not Scorch. Maybe that's why they didn't have them talk, because all of them had different voices, and it would have just been confusing. That actually is an interesting theory. Maybe a lot that's of fans wondered why they didn't have a bigger role. Maybe that's why, because they couldn't have any of them talk, because then if they had other people to go in there for the voices, then it would be really confusing, because like, with their clones, how are they going to sound different? Then if they don't have to have they didn't play the games, what the hell is wrong with these people? But I don't know, I give up. Quentin, just go, man. Just, just go. Oh, 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 oh! You know I would also like to see in the Clone Wars? Oh, no. Um... Uh, you, you know, the, have, you, have any of you ever heard of this one planet on Star Wars? No. El Camino! Dude, I already had you. I'm joking. Um, I really want to see, I don't know, some more expanded planets that, you know, more unique environments that aren't just forests and stuff, like cities, civilizations. That's one like thing that I've really liked about the Clone Wars is how varied their environments have been compared to some sci-fi shows which stick to the traditional methods 
because they have animation, they can. Because they have animation, they can do a multitude of different. <laughs> you can keep talking at the same time. It's really confusing. <laughs> Why did you shut up to the other person? Okay, fine. Quentin, go. Okay, um, so I like seeing cities. But you have Coruscant. They at least have a battle in the cities, like a giant all-out war. You're probably gonna get the battle, like Coruscant. Isn't that, isn't that what we had with Christosis? Christosis. Sorry. The battle Sorry. of Christos. Yeah, but it wasn't like a giant cramped city that you could like go around turning like Avengers style, where it's all cramped and you've got Christosis. all these ships flying in and out of buildings. And Christosis. I don't, I don't know why, but I've always wanted to see that. I guess that might be interesting. All right. Christosis. And of course, more common villains. More common who? What? I mean, Kaminoans? Kaminoans? Kaminoans. Yeah, from Kamino, Kaminoans. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I, I don't think... Yeah, I think they're actually pretty cool. I'd like to see some variety within the Kaminoans. Like, they aren't all just uh, these... They all look the same. I don't know. I've only seen one, two, three, four, Remember that? That um that one medical Kaminoan from the uh, Malevolence arc. Malevolence. 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 Sorry, but Malevolence. But that was that was actually pretty cool. I think she was like some sort of medical officer or something. That was a different. Like show them doing stuff like outside of just being cloners. Ah, uh, cloners. I can understand that. Oh, no, no, it could be terrible. There was a Kaminoan, Kaminoan Jedi. That would be pretty cool, too. Oh, but there already was one. I remember that, but I just was... What? He dies. In the Clone Wars? No, before the Clone Wars. Yarl Poof! Yarl Poof! Yarl Poof wasn't the Kaminoan! Was it? Oh, wait, he looked like a Kaminoan. You failed! You imbecile! <laughs> what? You I don't... You fools! You've been excommunicated! You can't excommunicate this me! This is unacceptable! <laughs> Are you sure he wasn't the captain? <laughs> I'm positive. I'm sure. How sure is this? Because well, look at his eyes! Have you seen his hands? Maybe he was like some kind of... Kaminoans only have three fingers! Maybe he was some kind of Kaminoan Kalish Mandalorian love child or something. That's much as I like the concept of hybrids, that is not exactly what his character is. He is a different species whose name escapes me. I don't care. He's a Kaminoan to me. His name is Yarl Poof. Yarl Poof, alright. I'll show you Yarl Poof. We're sure he's not a, 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 a Kaminoan. Yes, we're positive. Well, we think we are. All right, do you want me to look it up? Really? You look it up during the podcast? Actually, yes, I would. What the fuck is this? It's madness. Okay, so we're going to skip Ronan while he, he, he looks up the species. And I'm going to say what else I'd like to see in Clone Wars. This is probably going to piss off the majority of our viewers right now. You know what I'd like to see? You know what they should do? You know what what is it? Okay. They put Deadpool in the show. He's <sighs> Shut the head up in fun. Yes, it would be cool. I thought, I thought, we're, I thought we're trying to stick to... Well, oh my goodness. Ah, here we go. Uh, here we go. Quermian. Quermian. That's what Jarl Poof, Poof is. Fascinating. Yeah, and his eyes, yeah, they don't look eyes. anything like that of a Kaminoan anyway. Yeah, Kaminoan's got those, like, black eyes, um... Yeah, the multifaceted yeah, the multi eyes. You can see stars in them. Like, like Rodian eyes, basically. Like eyes, basically. Or that of Nautilans. I guess if I had one other wish, it would be that we get to see the uh, young Jedi characters return with a lot more character development for each of them. Um, and, of course, they're not killed off. What if, so. 
Oh, what if one of them turned evil? No, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. No, you can't edit my reason. Okay, let's uh, wrap this up. Wait, I didn't Wait, give my... I, 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 I have one. I have one. Okay, yeah, you, both of you too. Yeah, yeah you, you genie, you can't take away our last of three wishes. <laughs> All right. <laughs> but, uh, okay, so I'll go. Okay. okay so I'll go. Another thing I want to see. You know what you, you know what they got to do? You know what they got to do? Eh? What? You know what? They got to, first of all, first of all, they get, they have to uh, not kill Ventress. First of all. Second of all, they get better not dismantle or disprove of whack. They better not deteriorate whack in any way, shape, or form. And thirdly, I, 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 refer back to the other two. Well, you know what? This, this, this is not exactly Clone Well, it's Clone Wars related. Hasbro needs to stop being douchebags. Amen! Yeah, I agree with you. I think we can all close on that note. That was basically my way. You take that person from the correct! And then they will die! Wait, that's not a bad quote. <laughs> and on that note, thank you for joining us this week. Um, but do you want to end it completely? Oh yeah, also, um, tell us what you think of our new audio format. If it's better than before, if it's not as good, it's hard to hear one of us, etc. Oh god, giant cats are trying to kill me, man! Stop! Stop! Stop it! People wonder why I hate cats. Right. Well. All right, guys. Yeah, this has been Clone Wars. Wait, Nathan. the cat. Um, you're not really your host, but still, I'm a co-host person. The cats, I tell you. Thanks for watching. Um. Next time we eat Skrillex. Hey,